From the grinding groove bite of an American monster to the flashing blue lights of an underwater assassin, today we look at creatures with the most powerful venom. Number 10. Cone Snail Making their homes in ornate shells shaped similar to their namesake, the various types of cone snails that roam the ocean are incredibly venomous. With a harpoon-like chitinous tooth that shoots out from its underside, the cone snail can deliver neurotoxins guaranteed to immobilize prey. But while humans may be too large for the snail to hunt, these attractive sea critters are just as dangerous to us. Symptoms associated with the cone snail's sting include pain, swelling, vomiting, and even muscle paralysis, blurred vision, and lethal respiratory failure. Number 9. Selenodon Resembling a large, long-nosed shrew, the endangered Selenodon is one of the few existing venomous mammals. Variations of this critter exist in the Caribbean among island nations like Cuba, Haiti, and the Dominican Republic. A nocturnal animal, the Selenodon, is rarely seen by people, but should you come across one, be sure to keep your distance. The submaxillary gland in this animal's jaw provides a toxic secretion that they may inject by way of their lower incisors. While only proving fatal to mice in testing, the venom crafted by selenodons is said to resemble the neurotoxic properties of some snakes and have even resulted in symptoms like convulsions, difficulty breathing, and paralysis. Despite this handy defense mechanism, though, selenodons are close to extinction and have already been mistakenly thought as such multiple times throughout history. Number 8. Gila Monster Traipsing along the southwestern desert regions of North America is a unique lizard known as the Gila Monster. Speckled with vivid shades of pink, orange, and yellow against their black bodies, these bead-scaled stalkers utilize these hues through a biological feature called aposmatic coloration to warn other creatures of their extreme toxicity. The first agony-inducing portion of this lizard's bite comes from its means of injection. The Gila monster first latches on with its grinding, grooved teeth and gnaws viciously at its target until venom is released from its salivary glands located in its lower jaw. This bite is incredibly painful and tough to break, sometimes requiring complete submersion in water to get the lizard to release its grasp or risk deep lacerations. The venom itself is equally as excruciating, with some victims describing the agony of the experience to feel like hot lava is coursing through your veins. Envenomized victims will suffer from symptoms like edema, a drop in blood pressure, and overall weakness in addition to the venom's unbearable sting. In terms of pure toxicity, the Gila monster's venom is on par with that of a coral snake, which has fatally bitten many human victims. Lucky for us, the Gila monster doesn't produce enough venom to keep humans down. So even though this lizard is a royal pain to run into, you're still likely to survive a run-in with this Loistland wandering beast. Number 7. Stonefish Nestled near the coast of northern Australia is a subtle danger hidden under the guise of a jagged rock. The stonefish is a genus of fish known scientifically as Sinensia and has earned its nickname through its mineralesque skin and jagged shape. The gray, rough texture of the stonefish masks a collection of 13 needle-sharp spines, which serve as a medium for injecting its neurotoxins into anything that gets too close for comfort. Unfortunately for humans, this includes feet. Seeing as the creature lives near coastlines and camouflages itself as to appear as nothing but an ordinary rock, stonefish tend to sting beachgoers often, with stonefish-specific antivenom being the second most commonly used in Australia. Exacerbating the situation for people, this fish is also capable of surviving outside of water for up to 24 hours, meaning you may not even need to enter the water to feel its sting. The venomous puncture of the stonefish is extremely painful, can cause heart failure, and even be lethal if not treated immediately. 
But if you're worried about this odd rocky sea creature threatening you, there's some good news. Stonefish don't use their venom on prey, relying instead on incredibly quick reflexes to snatch other fish that assume the stonefish is part of a coral reef. Their venomous spines are purely for defensive purposes, so just try not to offend them. Number 6. Slow Loris When considering venomous creatures across the world, creepy critters like spiders and snakes are quick to come to mind. But what about monkeys? Well, maybe not monkeys, but one closely related venomous primate is the slow loris. Categorized by its lemuresque head and tarsier-like eyes, this furry animal makes its home in the rainforests of Southeast Asia. Here, the tree-climbing creature survives on a diet of bugs, birds, reptiles, eggs, tree sap, and nectar. With the majority of its food being smaller and rather defenseless, the slow loris doesn't require venom for its prey, but rather to help dodge would-be predators and competing primates. Along with being the only extant primate to be venomous, this mammal is also special in that it produces not one, but two separate venoms, excreted from a gland on its forearm and through saliva respectively. These two different venoms are combined while the slow loris grooms itself. Once both venoms are present on its outwardly jutting lower teeth, called a tooth comb, this animal is then equipped to deliver a painful bite and spread the toxic concoction to any enemy that might get too close. Number 5. Blue-Ringed Octopus Scrounging along the seafloor of the Indian and Pacific Oceans near Australia and Japan, the crustacean-eating creature known as the blue-ringed octopus is as dazzling as it is dangerous. Adorned in more than 50 distinct brightly iridescent blue-hued rings, this octopus shifts the rest of its skin to mimic its environment similar to other octopuses. What sets its vivid coat apart, though, is the way this animal reacts when threatened. Immediately turning a shade of bright yellow, the blue-ringed octopus will flash its brilliant azure orbs toward approaching enemies in a display of aposematic coloration, warning other animals of the danger it conceals. Considered one of the most venomous sea creatures in the world, a single specimen of this cephalopod carries enough venom to take out two football teams, their coaches, plus the referee. The blue-ringed octopus unleashes tiny, negligible bites when cornered, but this just makes the effects of its venom more difficult to detect until the symptoms begin setting in. Its venom contains a plethora of harmful chemicals, and those affected are sure to experience nausea, respiratory arrest, heart failure, and even effects like paralysis and blindness. With no antivenom available, victims of a blue-ringed octopus bite are left turning to first aid techniques like artificial respiration to survive the quick-acting symptoms of paralysis. Number 4. Funnel Web Spider while many might think of the brown recluse or the black widow when the topic of venomous spiders arises, the funnel web spiders of Australia are a top contender for the world's most dangerous arachnid. Found throughout the outback in a variety of sizes and species, these spiders are notable for their burrow-like nests that they construct from their webbing. Within these funnels, the spider will take cover and await unsuspecting prey such as insects, snails, and even frogs or lizards. To make matters even more creepy, funnel web spiders build these homes between rocks, within trees, or under houses. They could be anywhere. This spells trouble for humans in Australia, as these eight-legged nightmares contain a highly dangerous venom. In larger species like the three-inch northern tree funnel web spider, one bite can start taking effect as quickly as 15 minutes after the bite, causing reactions like extreme perspiration, hypertension, muscle spasms, nausea, altered consciousness, and pulmonary edema. With the advent of antivenom, fatality rates have decreased from funnel web spider bites, but their spread across the southern continent continues to be a menace with potential danger lurking around every corner. Number 3. Death Stalker Scorpion As yellow as the wasteland sand it crawls, few scorpions are more volatile than the Death Stalker. Found throughout the dunes of North Africa, West India, and nearly every desert in between, the Death Stalker scorpion is notorious for its powerful neurotoxic venom. Requiring only a trace dosage to prove damaging, this scorpion's venom is known to be especially lethal for at-risk humans such as children, those with sensitive medical conditions, and the elderly. For a full-grown healthy adult, though, the sting of this scorpion can still have lasting effects. 
Anaphylactic shock is a risk for many who may not be aware of their own potential allergic reaction and evidence of pancreatitis for those who survive the sting has been discovered as well. Number 2. Box Jellyfish Capable of instantly stunning or even executing small prey like fish and shrimp, the gooey sea creature's venom assaults the heart, nervous system, and skin cells of its targets. The toxins secreted from the tentacles of the box jellyfish are activated once they come into contact with specific chemicals found on an enemy creature's skin. These toxins are harmful to humans and are so dangerously painful, in fact, that many victims go into shock or experience heart failure, causing them to perish underwater long before they can reach the shore. Those that do make it out of the grasp of the box jellyfish are prone to experience pain for weeks on end and are left with crude scarring as a souvenir. Swimmers, divers, and surfers are recommended to stay far away when exploring the waters near Northern Australia and the Indo-Pacific Ocean. They have tentacles that can stretch up to 10 feet in length, and each tentacle is equipped with around 5,000 stinging cells. Number 1. Inland Taipan Perhaps the most frightening on this list, the Inland Taipan is a specialized hunter in that its venom is specifically attuned to slay mammals. A single bite from this Australian snake possesses enough venom to eliminate a hundred full-grown men. The Inland Taipan strikes multiple times when provoked, and victims can pass in half an hour if not treated immediately. Luckily, this snake is reclusive and remains sheltered from human society. Still, the Inland Taipan's toxicity is undeniable, making it among the most dangerous snakes in the world.